Hello there, how are you doing? Um, I'm in my studio, me and my dog. Mia's been very, very quiet today. She um, She's had her dinner tonight and she's wandered over over to the studio from from our humble abode but um she's not she's not terribly up or anything a very old lady she she um she wasn't interested in eating her breakfast this morning which is very unusual for her anyway She's happy here with me, sleeping on the floor. She's got a bed over there, but she wants to sleep on the floor just there. Anyway, <clears throat> I was, um, <clears throat> yeah, when I was 14 years old, I, I made a sign at school and it said Mr let's call him what well, we'll call him Mr Boswell because I've called him that before that wasn't his real name it said Mr Boswell is a big fat bastard and I pinned it on the uh, art room wall this was a Friday afternoon and uh, forgot all about it went home on the Monday on the Monday morning, probably late, because I was always late for school, uh, we were all in sitting in the classroom. I think it was a maths class, so I wasn't very interested. And everyone was called out one by one. All the kids, one by one, went out, came back, went out, came back. And it was my turn. I went in, and there was Mr. Boswell and the Dominie. The Dominie was the headmaster. I don't know why they called him Dominice. He was uh, he was there, so I knew it was serious. And there on the blackboard was the sign. Do you know anything about this? No, he was a Scotsman. Do you know anything about this? Um, I said yes. <laughs> that's that's my work. And uh, there was nothing else said. Just hold out your hand. And he had the tours, the strap. I don't know if we called it the tours at school or the strap, or maybe we called it something else. Um, yeah, so I had to hold out my hands and I got one, I got three, three hits and I thought that would be it, but no. He wanted to do the other hand as well, three hits on that. And it's bloody painful, that tours. And uh, after he'd done it, I I just ran out of the classroom. First of all, I ran into the next door where we'd all been sitting. Called, called all my mates, all those bastards, whatever you, for not letting me know what was going to happen. And then I just ran out of the school or went home or went somewhere, I don't know. I was 14, it was just before the um, O levels or the leaving certificate or whatever. So I didn't get any of that. I didn't go back to school. I never went back to school. Except occasionally when they, the uh, truant officer came round and threatened me mum. So I didn't get any any uh, exams, but not that I would have done very well at them anyway. I wasn't terribly good at school, except for art and uh, English. I like writing, although I didn't know much about English as a subject. I knew that I liked writing poetries and stuff, um, but I, I didn't know all the grammar and punctuation, so I probably wouldn't have done very well in that either. So anyway, that's by the by. So that was the end of my school career. And uh, I'm going to paint it. I'm going to paint what happened. I'm going to paint the scene now on this board that I've just sort of covered in white, titanium white at the moment because it had a drawing of a cat on that was unsuccessful. 
and that's what I'm about to do. I'm going to make a painting of that s scenario. I've got over it now, but I, I was angry about it for a long, long time. I mean, you know, I was in a bad state anyway at that time. Didn't really know I was in a bad state. I was just sort of rebellious. Um, and uh, of course that didn't do me that punishment, which was extreme, by the way. I mean, he was, he was a big fat bastard. <laughs> Uh, I don't know what it was that annoyed him. Perhaps it was being called fat. But anyway, yeah, that it's six of the best. It's far too much. And uh, he seemed to enjoy it, you know. I mean, I don't think that I could possibly do that to a child. Could you do that to a child? Punish them painfully like that. Could you do that? I couldn't do it. I don't think many people would want to do it. Even school teachers. Ah, oh, I suppose I suppose it was to teach me a lesson. Didn't teach me a lesson at all. Well, not in not the lesson that he wanted it to teach me. It just taught me that he was an even fatter bastard than I originally thought. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to have a go at painting that scene on this board. Uh, I'll see you later when I've got on a little bit. Well, it's about an hour later and I've sort of set the scene. Um, I mean, it's got to be vaguely something like that. The Domini was there. The fat bastard was there. And I was there. There was no one else there. It was an empty classroom. So that's where we are at the moment. I've got a lot to do. I'll keep going for a little while. Sorry about the language. Well, it's, I don't know, about half past one in the morning now. I've made myself a flask of tea to keep me going all night. And a sandwich. And, uh, That's what happens when I get in painting mode. Um, uh, I don't know how long, how many. It's taken me ages. I'm at this stage now, I'll let you see. Um, it's a slow, slow process. I have to look. Is that, does that pose look right? Does that look right? Uh, I'll keep going. I'll hopefully show you the finished result. Well, I'm still at it. Some hours later, <laughs> some many hours later, I've been struggling. And I've been struggling, believe it or not, with that little boy's face. I can't get him right. But I'll... I'll keep going. Good morning. It's, um, oh, it's no good looking at that clock. <coughs> I think it's about half past eight in the morning now. I've been working all night on my painting. Um, listened to several radio plays bit knackered now. I suppose I'd better get to bed. Oh, you want to see that? Oh, well, uh, I've signed it, but I, you know, I've enjoyed doing it, but it's just, I'll show it to you. <coughs> Excuse me. What the? Something's rolling across the floor then. So there it is. Mr. Boswell is a bastard painting. <laughs> I think I'll call it the punishment. 
Oh, the tours. I think the punishment is a good name for it. Anyway, I'm going to bed now. Must be a bit bloody mental. I hope you've enjoyed this little video. And I hope to see you again soon. Bye bye for now. Me down there. Stayed with me all night, bless her. Bye. Bye.